All right, guys, here we go. So we have filled up about 20 gram of each paint into these eight ounce or 10 ounce uh, plastic cups. And what we're gonna do is we're going to subject them under vacuum. They're inside a, an, an acrylic vacuum chamber and we're gonna close the lid. All tore are in absolute pressure. So we're about 730 or 40 tore, absolute pressure. So the valve is closed right now, but I'm gonna close the venting valve and I am going to turn on the pump. So the pump is on and I am going to open. We're gonna start pulling vacuum. And so right now, we're about 500, 400, 300, uh, 250, 200, 150, 100, about 50 tor. So once you pass about 30 tor, this is what happens. There we go. It starts boiling like crazy. We're at about four tor right now. Three tor. Two tor. About almost one tor. And this is what's going on. So there's a lot of and degassing happening with these uh, liquids. And it looks like the grayish one, the one is dark gray blue, color number two is black, and color number three is white. And so it looks like color number one is releasing a lot of gases. We are at about 191 microtor. So we're about three minutes in, and it looks like that most of the gas from color number two and three has been removed. There is still some boiling going on. It is not as visible as with the color number one. Okay, so we are back and we are about eight minutes after we've left. So we have let this degas for about eight minutes. It looks like most of the gas has uh, come out. What we're going to do is we're going to turn off the vacuum pump and we are going to release the vacuum. Pump is off and right now what we're gonna do is we're gonna release the vacuum. Here we go. And this is how it looks like. It's essentially degassed paint. It looks like it has the same texture, same viscosity and the same temperature as before uh, degassing. Uh, some liquids don't, uh, but this paint actually does. And let's take a look at here about the same thing. It has the same um, viscosity, texture, as well as temperature 
uh, as before it uh, went into degassing. And then here we go with the matte black one. Again, once again, it is same viscosity and texture and the temperature. So there you guys have it. Uh, preliminary degassing results and um, what it looks like when you degas paint. Uh, thank you very much for watching and uh, see you next time.